WB Mason postgame as we recap a wild night at Fenway where the Yankees win it 6-3. to A couple different lead changes and, of course, a big four-run eighth inning for the Yankees. Aaron Judge and Giancarlo Stanton right in the middle of it. Let's hear from Aaron Boone now in the Manager's Report brought to you by Geico. Aaron, we've spoken so many times this season about what a roller coaster ride it has been for you guys. But how do you describe the range of emotions from that seventh inning until the end of the eighth? Um, oh man. Um, you know, just just awesome games to be a part of here you know especially obviously when we come out on the winning side but to see our guys competing to see them playing as well as they are and also surviving a couple of mistakes right I mean that's and, and that's one of the messages especially this time of year you know you can't get bogged down by a mistake that's inevitably going to happen you know and it can seem huge at the time um, you got to just keep on competing and you got to be able to move on quickly to the next play and uh, these guys are in that mode right now. And, uh, you know, they're, they're just, you know, they don't want to be denied. You've been unbelievably positive and unbelievably confident when it has come to this team throughout the course of this season. But for them to win six in a row, go to Fenway Park, sweep the Red Sox, just how proud are you of the effort and what they've shown over the last really three games? Yeah, I, I love I love the frame of mind they're in, the fight they're in, just the way they're competing. Um, you know, it's important to, you know, and I think everyone in that room understands we haven't done anything yet, but it's fun to to be in the fight with them and to be competing the way that they are. Um, we understand that, um, you know, every game takes on greater importance. We look forward to having an off day tomorrow and, and taking a breath and, and, and then getting right back after it after a great, uh, against a great opponent uh, on Tuesday. And we know we got to move on to that, to that game and that challenge, and we look forward to it. You mentioned mistakes, and you look at the judge at bat in the eighth. It looked like he was done there. Just can can you take me through what you're thinking as he essentially gets an, an extra an extra strike there? Yeah, I didn't know that at the time. It just from from our vantage point, and actually you saying that is <clears throat> it, it looked like just a foul tip that wasn't caught. Um, so that's how well, that's what we're how we processed it. Um, but it was just a great battling at bat. Um, you know, obviously, Otto can be so tough on right-handed hitters. We know that. Um, and, and I thought he executed a lot of pitches against them, and he was able to survive long enough to finally get one that he was on time for and, and, and stuck it. You know Giancarlo Stanton is, is a good hitter, but this series in particular, a home run in every game. What did you learn about him as far as his clutch performance ability in this series when it really matters most? You know, in a way, he's come up big all year. You know, he's, he's. I mean, obviously, this is Fenway Park, and we're battling with them, and these games were, you know, so big that maybe it's to another level. But he's been coming up big for us in big situations all season long. Um, obviously, he's he's locked in right now and playing so well, and he's so focused. Um, so I'm I'm happy for him and proud of him, um, and and love the fact that he's in such a good place.